What's cooking, peeps? This is Intelligence, and this is how to set up OBS Studio. Tectonic separation, making it look like a pain in the nation. Being used, it can't keep sitting and waiting for the station to tune in. The communication say we all be fighting in the meditation. I'm giving proof under the roof of revelation, inflation. All right, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and download OBS Studio. If you're going to be using any doors like myself, um, there's something else that we need to do. I'm using Logic Pro uh, down here because I'm an artist, so I'm recording all the time. And I want to record me playing guitar, singing, rapping, etc. So what you'd have to do is jump over here first on the Safari. After you've downloaded your OBS, you want to go in the search bar. You want to type in Black Hole. This is the name of the audio driver, and you want to go to. I keep going down here. I don't think this is our first one. It might be. Uh, existential audio. Uh, so you want to come down here. Put your credentials in here. Uh, subscribe for the free Mac download. Download that. Uh, this is a multi output device. Um, it's going to help you put your audio interface into the laptop and to be able to use OBS Studio. Okay, so you want to take this down. Um, and the first thing we want to do now is open up OBS Studio. So open up your OBS Studio. I'm going to click right here. I'm going to open this one. Okay, so we're on OBS Studio. Now, when you get this, you're not going to see anything down here. It's going to be a blank screen, kind of like maybe this. There's going to be nothing there. The border won't be there either. None of it's going to be here. Everything's going to be gone. So, and I like this. Okay, I'm just going to enable mine again. I'm going to put them back on so you can see what's happening. Um, You want to come down here onto the left. Uh, scenes. Let me, bigger, let me make it bigger for you. I'm going to come down here on scenes. You want to press plus. And then a new scene. Okay. And then the first thing we want to do before we even touch this is go to command and space bar on your Mac and type in audio MIDI setup. Okay, so you want to go to your audio MIDI setup and click on you. And the first thing we've got to do is create another device. The plus sign here. You want to create the multi output device. And then you should have something looking like this. Where you want your master device to be the black hole that you just downloaded. And remember that this is a multi-output device. So this is exactly what we need. You click on this. And then you want to come down here to audio devices. And you want to select your black hole 2 channel. Or you might have installed the 16 channel. So tick the one that you've installed. And then up above it or down below it. You want to look for your audio interface. And you want to tick that as well. Okay, you want to come out of here now. Next thing you want to do, you want to jump back over to OBS. Um, let's have a look. You want to go into the settings, down here on the right. Click settings. Straight into audio. You want desktop audio to be black hole. You want to change this. And then down here in one of your mic auxiliary audios, you want to put, as I've got your black hole as well. Uh, go all the way down to advanced monitoring devices. That's going to be the device that you've just created. So put that in there. Okay, once we've done that, I think that's it. Uh, yeah, once we've done that, we'll click OK. That's done. You want to come out of OBS. I'm going to go over here to the little apple in the corner. System preferences. And just check another thing before we go ahead. Uh, you want to go into sound. Come over here into input device. We've got black hole 2 channel. Make sure this is selected. Uh, over here into output. And you want to make sure that the device that you just created is you. Selected. Alright, come out here. And we can go back into our OBS studio and continue. Okay, so what we want to do is click here on the plus and add your source into your scene. 
Um, my border is the little red border you can see around you. My camera is my Mac camera looking at me. And then I've got my desktop screen in the background recording. Okay, let me just help you out here. I think when you're adding your desktop screen, you're going to have to press plus. Uh, add video capture device. So you want to add your video capture device. And this is what this is right here. Okay, so you want to add in your desktop audio. Once you've added in your desktop audio, you want to click on the little setup. Advanced audio properties. Uh, these are my settings here. Just make sure everything's kind of the same. You want to X this out. And then you want to go down to your audio interface that you've added in. If you haven't already, go back, add in your audio interface right here. Okay, so my Scarlett, that's my audio interface, my Scarlett 2i2 focus right. And then I want to click on the settings here. I want to go into properties. I want to make sure this is click the Scarlett 2i2. And I want to go back up to the desktop audio. Click settings. Properties. And make sure this device is uh, set to black hole. Okay, I'm gonna X out here. All right, though, because one more thing to do if you're recording through a door, and you want uh, you want OBS to work with your door. I'm using Logic Pro, so I'm gonna take this down for a minute and minimize this. I'm gonna go into Logic Pro and open up a project I'm already working on. Now I'm gonna go over here to Preferences, you want to come down to audio, you want to come down to output device and make sure it's selected to, in to the device that you just created, mine's called intelligence internal audio OBS so that's what I've selected you in the drop down and then down in the input device you want to select your audio interface. For me, it'd be the Scarlett 2i2. Okay. That's it. This is over on audio, so make sure you click over on audio if you can't find. All right. X out the year. All right, should we so get some sound coming through here now? I'm going to click play. And if all is good. Ooh. Space bar on you. Obviously, my mic is working. I've got my mic set up through my focus right audio interface box. Also, I play guitar, so I'm gonna pick up a guitar. If you play guitar, just plug it into your second input. Turn that up, and we should be good to go. Alright, cool. We're gonna X out of this. I'm gonna make sure everything else is working. I'm gonna go into a sound I already got. I'm gonna go into one of my tracks. I open this up. Voila. I'm gonna open up my OBS again just to show you. I can see this coming through on my desktop audio. And hear my voice coming through on the Scarlet mic. Same when I play the guitar, you'll hear that pinging up on there too. And that's it. So you set up OBS Studio. Peace.